AD1, welcome. I am crazy excited today because what we're going to be doing is using a video tool that is free. It is crazy easy and it is, it, oh my gosh, it's, it's going to make your video so professional. It's going to make this so easy. So even if you are a person who considers yourselves, uh, yourself to be challenged with technology, um, I promise you this will take it out of it. So I need you to go to spark.adobe.com. All right. And I'll include this in the post as well, but you're going to go to spark.adobe.com. So Adobe has this free resource called Spark, right? And then uh, you'll create a free login and then what you'll do, and they also have a mobile one that you can use. Um, so you'll just say, uh, get started now. And so I will log in if it makes me log in again. And it does not, which is super duper. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna go to this right here. And it says, what do you wanna create? A post, a page, or a video? Because it'll actually do social media graphics for you and all that kind of stuff. So when I'm worried about this right now, what we're worried about right now is this right here, your video. So with your video, this is just gonna be uh, your title. So it says just, and so all I want you to do for your title is just put in my story, right? So then you're just gonna go to next. So here's a cool thing, is um, <clears throat> it's gonna give you like different templates that you can use, all right? So uh, what I do is uh, you could just go to like personal growth, for example. So it will start to create the whole template for you. Now, do me this favor though, okay? This is very, very important. I know sometimes we skip this stuff, but watch these tutorials. Because for real, this tutorial just shows you exactly what to do. So you know what? Let's just watch it right now. So really honestly, it's just that easy. So you just say, okay, I'm ready. So right here, it just has uh, basic slide stuff. Now you can put, you can like create all these uh, slides on like how it, and this slide thing right here is basically how it transitions. All right, um, and this will show you a transition as well. It just slides down from the top. This one is a snap, it snaps towards you when it does the transition stuff. So. This one's more of a transition thing. So uh, your first one, um, we're just gonna put some text on there and we're just gonna say, um, I asked you to watch this video as a favorite, but there's more to it. So the next one, first, intro, background. All right, and so you're just gonna go, now here's the thing too, is this is where you say how long that slide's gonna be. So I usually try to have mine um, six to seven seconds, just because it gives you enough time. So if I keep it at two, let's just hit the play button so you can see it. If I keep it at two, you'll see it's way too short. My internet connection is slow, but um, trust me when I say just when you put this at two seconds, it's way too short. So keep it uh, six to seven, but don't don't have any more than seven seconds. Otherwise, it just kind of stays up there for too long. Um, 
There we go, seven seconds. Now, there they did say about recording narration. Now, <clears throat> I've only had one person do that. Um, I don't suggest that you do that because the whole idea is that you've got your words, right? And then you've got, you can put your, uh, your image on here, right? So you upload your photo. So you can put a photo on there. But you're gonna let your words and your photo visually talk to the person. And then you're gonna let your music, and then you add your music on here, you're gonna let your music set the emotional tone, right? So they've got a bunch of different, if you wanna go for an inspiring one, you may go for uh, the happy music or rousing, like bringing change. Right, but the thing is, is that that right, was crazy for me. But but so the thing is this: is that you want your music to set the tone. <clears throat> so in the video that you watched, that's my example. You see that the that the music really set an emotional tone, and then I just had you focused on my words per slide and my picture per slide, so your mind. When you watch my video, my, my idea was that the music sets an emotional tone, but then my words and my pictures stay up there long enough so that you connect the dots between you and me regarding that video as you watch it. So there's a connection automatically between um, the viewer and the person who made it. So this is, this is all you have to do. So here's a cool thing. At the end of it, um, you're just gonna share, right? So uh, you're gonna pick a category, you gotta make sure you do that. So I just pick uh, education. And we do all that stuff. And go to the bottom, you say create public link. All right, and so if you're gonna do a public link, it's gonna create it for you. So for right now, all I want you to do is when you get done with your video, is to share your public link as a response to the post. All right. Um, I'll show you how to actually put it on a web page in a couple of days when we uh, build the Who Knows a Guy sites. So for right now, um, all we're going to do is just share this uh, this video link, and there it is. So you'll just share this right here, right? So you just copy it. Um, when we do end up sharing it, we're going to do the embed part, and you'll embed it there. We are not going to post these on Facebook. We're not going to post these to Twitter. Because if you do that, you totally lose the intimacy of it. Um, we're not going to send this out in a mass email because you completely lose the intimacy, the follow-up, you lose everything, right? So just please follow this step by step. So today, just create or work on creating your video. I don't expect you to have it done today. We have really this is this is the Monday assignment. So you got today um, and tomorrow and really Wednesday. Um, I'd love for you to be able because part of tomorrow is going to be where you're going to post a draft of it. Um, but we have to get done this week, ideally by Wednesday, that way we can have time to view them and suggest changes if any of them need to be made and all that kind of good stuff. So all you do is once you're done, copy this and then get onto the Facebook uh, page where the 81 group is at and post it on your uh, day, uh, it'll be day seven post is where I'm going to ask you to post this. All right, make sure you have a great day. You know, you know I'm going to, you as well. Take care.